Welcome to Fox Taxi, everyone. In today's video, we're going to explore how to turn off Wi-Fi for certain apps on your iPhone. While iOS doesn't offer a straightforward way to block specific apps from accessing Wi-Fi like it does with mobile data, there are still some creative solutions we can work with. I'll walk you through a method that, while not perfect, can help you achieve what you're looking for. First, let's clarify the difference between apps accessing the internet through mobile data versus Wi-Fi. When it comes to mobile data, iOS makes it easy to manage which apps can use it. If you go to the settings app and navigate to the cellular section, you'll see a list of apps with toggles next to them. This lets you turn off mobile data access for specific apps, which is great for saving data on limited plans. However, when it comes to Wi-Fi, the situation is a bit different. Wi-Fi is usually considered unlimited or at least less restricted than mobile data. So iOS doesn't offer the same simple controls for blocking specific apps from using Wi-Fi. This can be a bit frustrating if you're trying to restrict internet access for certain apps while still allowing others to connect. So what can you do? The closest solution available on iOS is to use the Shortcuts app to create automations. The idea here is to set up a couple of automations, one that turns off Wi-Fi when you open a specific app, and another that turns Wi-Fi back on when you close that app. It's not a perfect solution, but it can work for your needs. Here's how you can set it up. First, open the Shortcuts app on your iPhone, then create a new shortcut that simply turns off Wi-Fi. You can do this by selecting the action set Wi-Fi and choosing off. Once that's done, save the shortcut. Next, you'll need to create an automation. Go to the Automation tab in the Shortcuts app and select Create Personal Automation. Choose App as the trigger, then select the app you want to restrict. Set the action to run your Wi-Fi off shortcut whenever this app is opened. After that, create a second automation that does the reverse. This time, the trigger will be when you close the app and the action will be to run a shortcut that turns Wi-Fi back on. You'll do this in a similar way by selecting the Set Wi-Fi action and choosing On before saving the shortcut. Now, whenever you open that specific app, Wi-Fi will turn off, and when you close the app, Wi-Fi will turn back on. It's not as seamless as having a direct setting within iOS, but it's a clever workaround that can help you manage Wi-Fi access for specific apps. While this method might not be ideal for everyone, it's a good option if you need to restrict Wi-Fi usage for certain apps on your iPhone. Keep in mind that this approach might not be perfect for every scenario, but it offers some flexibility where iOS's built-in features might fall short. Thanks for watching. I hope this video has given you a helpful solution for managing Wi-Fi access on your iPhone. If you found this video useful, be sure to like and subscribe to Foxtech C for more tech tips and tutorials. See you guys later.